a very good morning to all of you welcome to stab exam forum student your exam is over and you might be waiting for your ta1 result so in between i thought why not to bring competition analysis okay so this analysis i have done based on the application received and the attendance what we have observed at the written exam many of the candidates are uh, told me in the comment section that the attendance was very less okay so based on their consideration i am bringing this competition analysis uh, what is the competition level how many candidates are fighting for one seat that we will try to see in this particular session okay so let's so let's begin the session so the outline of session will be like this first uh, we will review the rti reply that we have seen in the last uh, video it is i think 2 3 months back okay and uh, we will also try to analyze what is the per seat competition for shortlisting for tier 2 exam that is skill test okay per seat competition we will try to look off okay so let's review the rti reply so as you can see we have um, made one rti uh, to get the number of applications how many people have applied so this is the uh, comparison you can see for assistant post it is almost 2 lakh people have applied so at that time we have calculated uh, the ratio per seat independent of reservation okay so it's coming high but uh, as we can see uh, that attendance was very poor so we'll try to reanalyze those figures okay with a reference to this particular exam okay so this video i have already posted if you have not watched you can have a look on that okay so let's analyze uh, what is the per seat competition for shortlisting for skill test okay student one thing to be noted that it is independent of reservation i am not considering any separate reservation uh, for me all posts are same okay for zone wise uh, different vacancies are there then you can calculate by your own okay so let's go to the excel sheet that i have prepared yeah so as you can see this actual sheet i have already open and uh, what you can see you can see uh, the post and the total vacancy uh, which is given in advertisement and the application received as per rti so as you know uh, for this particular tier 2 that is skill test they will be shortlisting five times of the vacancy so i have al calculated the five times of the total vacancy so as you can see the formula it is five times of c2 that is five times of 339 and uh, it comes around 695 similarly i do with all these post okay so let's see the mean attendance uh, one by one so as you can see uh, i will fill up this table as we proceed so first we'll see the 10% only 10% people have attended uh, the exam or you can say they have appeared for the exam okay so let's see how many candidate uh, should be appeared as per the rti application so it is 10% of this mean attendance so out of uh, 187000 18744 candidates appear if attendance is 10% okay for assistant let's see the per seat competition for this time i will not uh, divide with rti application i will divide with the candidates appeared divided by the short listing because uh, these many candidates will be short listed for skill test okay so it's come out to be 11 so since uh, this attendance is low so since candidates appear is low so you can say for one seat 11 candidates were fighting for the skill test not for the overall exam for the skill test okay this is a phase wise i am uh, doing let's see for the other post as well with the 10% so candidate appears comes to like this and if you see 
with 10% attendance you can see the maximum competition is for assistant space since uh, there is only two vacancies are there and the applications were huge as compared to PA where only vacancy is one but application received is around 2000 this minimum is Tano 14 post very less vacancy and JPA see JPA those who have applied they are they must be very happy to look this four figure because uh, if the attendance is really 10 percent then there will be four per seat competition okay so let's copy this figure I am putting it here so that uh, we have overall analyze okay uh, since I have done a formatting let me format it because this is not there is no decimal so let's remove the decimal okay I will do the formatting for all these okay so as you know if you know the mathematics you are good in quantitative I know you have catch my mistake so just you need to double it okay uh, so it will become two times of this okay so just do that or otherwise if you want to verify just increase 20 okay so as you can see it is similar so I did a good mathematics here <laughs> okay anyhow leave it so you can see uh, it is similar again for this it will be three times of 10% okay obviously uh, with as the attendance increases the competition will also increase okay this will be the four times oh, okay okay so as you can see it will uh, linearly increase as you can see it is uh, because we are linearly uh, increasing in attendance so your per seat competition will also linearly increase okay anyhow what I am trying to say that if the vacancy is between 30 and 40 maximum and minimum it can be 10 percent maximum it can be 40 percent that's what I want to show you so as you can see the maximum competition is for the UDC because vacancy are small for assistant 44 uh, candidates are fighting for one seat for getting into the skill test again I am telling you it is not the uh, final selection it is for the skill test okay and uh, the maximum competition is in assistant space if we consider 40 percent attendance and uh, the minimum is in JPA where one candidate is fighting uh, 16 candidates are fighting for one seat okay so that's it yes so this is the overall picture that I am sharing with you so that you get a confidence right so this is much as a competition okay so you ha must have a good probability if you have attempted this question uh, in the written exam very well so the competition is not uh, much higher as we have seen in different SSC exam and banking exam okay so competition for assistant is uh, if it is 40 percent attendance then 44 per seat is the competition okay so anyhow you have seen this video I guess uh, the scale safe score and cutoff analysis we have done and the queries uh, still I am waiting for the answer but I don't know uh, when answer will come whether uh, leave it whether it is overall or sectional let's wait for your result okay and uh, in the next session I will bring the skill test labels and stay tuned and if you are not subscribed to our channel subscribe to our channel and like us and share it with your friend as well thank you for watching it